Hey YouTube, this is Gohan from Dragon Ball Z. You're watching Amatu Ray Killer HD, the ultimate Super Saiyan. Hey, what's up, guys? It is me, Amatu Ray Killer, bringing you a video on Dragon Ball Idol. Now, the thing is that I don't know if this is going to work because our baby doesn't have that much dodge. So if he does work and we have that much dodge, then we can make this video. All right, so we dodged one. That's one. He dodged zero there. Now, every time he dodges three times, he gets a shield. All right, so at the moment, let us heal him to full health. Let's see exactly what he does before the battle ends, hopefully. So at the moment, we're just going beast mode. Let me just do this right now. He dodged right there. That's number two. But because there's bleed in it, uh, then he just sucks ass. All right, he dodged, and that's three right there. All right, now, every time he does dodge, that's one. Every time he does dodge, there is a chance to get another shield after that one pops. So that one popped, he dodged right there, boom. As you can see, dodged right there. Now, if that one pops, then um, then you get one more, basically. Now, the reason why he is so weak is because I have him in hero, um, hero, <laughs> hero resonance with um with the Belmont and I just have a a god rapid on Belmont uh just to make this video possible but you guys saw what happened right you guys saw exactly what happened where he had a shield it popped they attacked he dodged and he popped again so basically that cool thing right there is meant to just like I feel like it's so OP all right now he was on my main team as my main tank I advise against it. I don't think he is main tank material. He is definitely like an off tank, third tank, like where he could just like go, you know, against any possible unit that is a back row unit, you know, except for Jiren. Jiren has hit guaranteed. Now, if you could buff up, sorry, if you could buff up his block and his dodge against Jiren, then it could be possible chance that it could be honestly just like, he could just like rub it off his shoulder, you know what I mean? Because then if Dispo follows up and attacks him and he dodges, three dodges automatically gives him a shield. Now you guys saw that right there. Let's go over here. Let's go to illustration. Let's see his attacks. Let's put him in God right now. All right. So the first thing right here, you guys saw his revenge death bomb. That shit looked amazing. All right. So you deal 110% attack damage to all targets, applying one taunt to one random unit. Pretty good right there. Now, the first passive is the shield. The hero gains a level mark, a level of mark after a dodge. When mark reaches three levels, it disperses the heal reduction effect while gaining a shield of 15%. Now, what is cool is it disperses heal reduction effect. That means that that's going to go away. His shield is going to be that 15%, plus he's going to get healed when the healing happens, unless the enemy does another heal reduction move on you now the thing is it does not say at all that you have to wait a cooldown so while you're in that shield as you guys saw in the battle while you're in that shield and you dodge three times right you're already set you don't have to dodge anymore because when that sh once that shield pops right once the shield pops and they attack you and you dodge you automatically get, get a shield again so that is just like freaking insane all right i think that's awesome now, for second passive, during a normal attack, reducing the target's damage by 20% lasts for two turns. That's fine. Reduces the damage. That's good. You know, just less damage going towards you anyway. Uh, and then this one right here, teleportation 15%, which also counts towards your marks that have to be level three to get a shield. All right. Teleportation and dodge considers into that right there. So now looking at the first god passive skill. 75% chance to uh, trigger counterattack. Now, I believe counterattack, when you do that, you counter with a normal attack, and then that goes into play this right here. So basically, every time you do a normal attack, it reduces damage reduction by 20% on the target itself. So that's that's good. You're, every time you get attacked, boom, 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 then you get a 75% chance to give them uh, a counterattack to then give them 20% um, damage reduction. Now, the second god passive skill, block, increases by 18%. Penetration increases by 20%. Usual shit. Attack, 80%. Dodge increases by 10%, which is very, very good. And why not? As for affinities, it's Miracle Trunks, Gohan. These are two very easy to get. And then the last thing you have to worry about is getting a Super Saiyan 4 uh, Vegeta. He's not on Hero Rescue yet. Hopefully, they add him soon. If not, you can do a classic pick pack 
or wait until the event. There is one event coming out, I believe. It is for Super Saiyan 4, Vegeta, and uh, Whis, I believe. Whis or Vados? I can't remember who it is, but you could get Super Saiyan 4, Vegeta, depending on how many of these points you actually have. Now, in the end, is Baby worth it? All right, is Baby worth it in the end? Personally speaking... As a main tank, he is not worth it. As an off tank, he is worth it. That dodge ability is awesome. Because if you go up against someone that has a high crit, high crit damage, let's say Gogeta, he's going to feel it. He's going to feel it. I almost got one-shotted by him. I had three quarters of the way health with a shield. Gogeta did his move. Freaking took out the shield and took him out in instantly. So I, that's why I was like, I got to take him out. I got to put Belmont back in. But if you guys have him as an off tank in third... You guys are set. And honestly, he is very cool. You guys saw his move and everything. But personally, that's my opinion on Baby. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys exactly think about Baby. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. All right, guys. Thank you very much for everything. Love and support. You guys are awesome. I love you. Thank you. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace. <laughs> Only you can do this. You are number one.